Yo, yo, it's your boy Mitch B on it. Back with another bang, baby. Check out. Oh, listen, man. We back and we better, baby. So I just want to say that I appreciate every single one of y'all that prayed for me to get better. If y'all ain't know, you know, I was down with the flu or with COVID. I don't really know, you know. If y'all know or y'all may not know, from what I think, the government's trying to bring back corona so that everybody could be distracted from the war that they started overseas and in Ukraine. If y'all don't know, I'm pretty sure the U.S. is trying to start World War III with this Israel-Palestine situation, you know. And I just hope that everything gets better with the Palestinian people because that's rightfully their land. You know, I'm not here trying to start a political debate or anything. That's just what it is. They stole their land. And they just trying to get it back. So, I mean, don't believe what you see on the news. That's what the news does. You know what I mean? They lie to you so that you don't see the truth. So, I just want to say that I was down for a cool week, week and a half. Because if y'all don't know about the, what Chicago did. Chicago brought about fifteen or 20,000 Venezuelans. And they have nothing for them and nowhere to put them. They put them in the police stations. They put them in the street. And I think that it's messed up. And you know what they did for the people that live in Chicago, if y'all don't know? They took a lot of our benefits. You know, if y'all don't know what Link, Link is like EBT. They took it from a lot of people. Or they, you know, if you were getting $200, now you're getting $50 a month. So that's what they did with me. They took my Link and they took my health insurance. I have no health insurance as of this moment because they gave all of our benefits to the Venezuelans. You know what I mean? I'm not upset about the situation, but... How stupid could a city be? You know what I mean? Y'all shitting on the people that live here to bring more people to a dub city. It don't make no sense. But I ain't going to bore y'all with all that. That's a conversation for another day, I think. So today, we got a shorty that snuck onto the plane and thought she was going to fly. Let's get right into it, man. Seated, Spirit Flight employees noticed a woman attempting to board the plane 45 minutes after the flight was ready for takeoff. When she was denied access, she took it upon herself to sneak onto the plane from outside, pushing past the flight attendants and jumping over passengers to get to her seat. The Crazy. flight attendant immediately called her supervisor as the suspect stated that she would assault someone if they did not fly the plane. Officers were alerted as she threatened to force the captain to fly the plane. Hey, hey. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I just, I just walk in. Little shorty, crazy. Uh, for what I understood, I just rushed in. Uh, the agent went to close the door, and there was one that was sitting on the flight and was refusing even to move. Philippe, is uh, Stephanie, uh, yeah. Stephanie inside? Is that better already? I was doing G4. She's inside. She's inside? She's inside the pool. Uh, the I just, let me just go in. Take because it. I think was one that was refusing uh, getting out. You sure he thought she was going to run some game, bro? No, oh, no, ain't no running game in no airport, and that's a fact. Spirit Airlines, of course. Damn, dude. If y'all gonna kick me off the flight, delay my flight because somebody wanna come late and think that they could get on, I'm gonna be pissed off, dude. This shorty man is selfish. You missed your flight, that's on you. You gotta put it on 150 people like that. It's going in bad. Alright. 
Hmm? If I don't go home, nobody go home. Hmm? Crazy. We're gonna beat the case. Oh. You know what I mean? They do it with a lot of people. They're going to take everybody out. Grab the ass and throw ass out. That shit is done. I knew he had something to say. Sour than a mother, G. Everybody else. What do you mean? That's dumb as They just want to have an attitude because they're miserable. They're miserable with their life. There's nothing for you to say. What is there for you to say? Like I said, y'all want to make my life hard, make everybody else's life hard. I want to go home. I don't even live here. That's weird. Y'all weird. But y'all mad because y'all really can't do anything. Everybody get off. Yep. Little hoping. This boy already sent my doctor information. Yeah, everybody getting off. Y'all too. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Let's go. You go in front of me. And she gonna go behind. You ain't never that stupid, though. Think you better get clout off this, so dude. Send it to me so I can send it to my daddy. I show only bad because they're definitely not walking behind me. Yeah, make sure y'all Instagram five people. That's crazy. I'm gonna get booked up, man. You know, I don't really be wishing somebody getting booked, dude, but if you're gonna do something like that. Y'all not necessary. What the hell? I have a 
ticket for this flight. And y'all trying to take me off the flight. It's no longer valid. What do you mean it's not valid? But everybody else is valid. We're going to have to yeah, relax. How? Relax. We're going to take your I'm relaxed. You're grabbing me. You're not grabbing your phone. I'm relaxed. You're grabbing me. Okay. What do you mean? Relax. Because why is he okay. grabbing me and I'm relaxed? Okay. Like okay. I said, he grabbed me. It's illegal as fuck. No, it's cool because I don't mind suing nobody. I don't mind suing Miami police. That's why he's shaking his head. He over y'all. He's shaking his head. And I'm on camera at the airport. This illegal as fuck. I have a ticket. And y'all mad because I have literally the plate got stopped because I have a ticket to go. My I'll, get you, I'll, get you, I'll get you, uh, My uh, what do you mean? She goes to jail for yeah. that. She, once she refused to get off the, the airplane, that's trespassing. Give, give me the info. I will. God damn, bro. Where'd he be finding these police? God damn. If you know he not me. a slew of charges, including disorderly conduct and destruction of aircraft. She was eventually sentenced to probation. She stated to the judge that she was wrong, but that the employees should have been nicer to her. Additionally, she had been arrested two years prior for something very similar, where she assaulted an employee at a fast food restaurant. I guess her fried. Damn, that's a big something difference, Something very similar, bro. where she assaulted an employee at a fast food restaurant. God damn, bro, that's two different people. Restaurant. I guess her fries were cold. If you enjoyed the... Damn, bro. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you, though. In some situations, no matter what you say, you ain't gonna know. You know what I mean? She came on the flat an hour later thinking she better be on. That's crazy. You know, I just don't know how she got past the employees like that. Dude, let me know y'all comments in the comments, baby. Those.